always wanted to restore this little pine dale jar it's just so gorgeous the line work is so fine it's been uh, it's been roughly glued up in the lab just to kind of find out what was here but and a lot of these joints are actually okay i'm pretty happy with a lot of it uh, but some of them no and this was splattered around the site what happened was this was probably sitting in C2, pretty much in room 38. You can see the little numbers on it. And what happened was uh, when the modern looters came in and they took a backhoe and they scooped that room up, they splattered a lot of it around. I noticed this one is labeled RW. That's an indication that uh, this was a piece that we found on the surface or was returned to us from the looting that happened uh, in the early 1980s and this is definitely a piece of this vessel you can recognize it from the fine line work of course but also from the interior brown color uh, more than gray so this is definitely part of this vessel in fact it, it goes it fits right here like that and what i need to do is clean up this old glue that's in here get this all out of there and out of here and we'll start one piece at a time reconstructing this make sure we get really good tight alignment i'm not going to take it all apart a lot of times you'd want to take this all apart start over but these are pretty good i'm not disappointed with a lot of these joints they line up really very well uh, a little bit off can change the whole thing when you get there but acetone evaporates very very quickly and the glue we use is acetone base and that allows you to take things apart, put things together, take them apart, put them together. That's the idea. You don't want to use anything that you cannot remove in any restoration. It's a slow process. You have to be very patient. That's pretty damn good. Okay, now our, our glue is an acetone based this is duco glue you get it at ace hardware it's acetone based it dries clear and it is acetone soluble so you can reverse everything now they make a version of the same glue you know this for you know museums and the only difference is it costs about 10 times as much okay i'm happy with that here we go here we go let's not fool around any excess, that's the thing. Don't worry about it. You can get that off later. Another thing, you cannot hold the piece. Well. I've seen people in the lab try to do this. You can't do that. Because you are, whether you know it or not, you're making all these little micro movements. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that. Right there. That's awfully freaking good. I'm pretty happy. Now, after that sets up... For a whole day, <laughs> I'm going to wait a whole 24 hours.